What about the use of garlic in racing pigeons? Are there any real benefits, or are the benefits in the eye of the beholder, i.e. the fancier who uses garlic products? Little scientific information for racing pigeons seems to be readily available, but it should be possible to extrapolate information from work done in humans and laboratory animals to pigeons. Garlic is one of mankind's oldest natural remedies, so it's no surprise that for generations fanciers have used it to promote the health of their pigeons. Before the systematic use of antibiotics in pigeon racing, Fanciers resorted to natural products to treat their pigeons, and garlic is certainly one of the plants that has been used the most. And in this video we will know, is garlic effective for the health of pigeons? Garlic is one of the most popular natural tonics given to racing and fancy pigeons, you may be surprised to learn that there is relatively little scientific literature describing its effectiveness. However, this does not mean that garlic is useless for pigeons. There is evidence that garlic may have a mild antimicrobial effect, providing protection to birds from certain potentially harmful bacteria, fungi, and yeasts in the environment. Garlic can also help boost the pigeon's natural immune system, increasing its ability to fight off any pathogens they may encounter. Some leaflets also believe that garlic can help the pigeon's body recover after a race, but this has not been scientifically studied. More and more fanciers wish to use natural solutions for prevention or cure. Garlic is one of the remedies that has its place in a suitable protocol against internal parasites, coccidia, as well as to make our pigeons more resistant to disease. Garlic has antimicrobial, antiseptic, anti-inflammatory, antibacterial, antibiotic, antifungal and antiviral properties which makes it a competent food to hunt and eliminate a large number of pathogenic bacteria when they manage to enter the body of our pigeons. It also improves blood circulation and provides respiratory tract protection and protection against verses. On this subject it has been found that pigeon fanciers who regularly give garlic to their pigeons are bad customers for veterinarians. Fanciers generally use two main methods to give garlic to their pigeons fresh garlic in drinking water and garlic oil on the bird's food. Generally, the oil is not pure garlic oil, rather it is a mixture of garlic oils and oilseed oils. Scientific investigation has revealed very few health benefits of garlic oils, most of the health effects actually come from using raw fresh garlic. Garlic oil appears to be most beneficial when used to glue vitamin or mineral powders to the grain, rather than any health impact from the oil itself. When fanciers feed fresh garlic to their pigeons, this is usually done by taking a raw clove, crushing or cracking it and placing it in the pigeon's water. It is generally safe, but it is very important to change the water daily. Although garlic has mild antimicrobial effects, it will remain rancid and become dangerous if left in the water for too long. When and how to give garlic to his pigeons. This is how professional fanciers practice, press 5 to 10 grams of peeled garlic, 2 cloves, using the garlic press, let stand for 20 minutes to promote the formation of allicin, take the crushed garlic with 30 milliliters of boiled water, cooled, filter and add to 1 liter of drinking water for your pigeons. Prepare a fresh solution daily and serve for 5 days before basketing or when youngsters have problems with this disease, wrongly called adenocoli. This natural cure will also be used if the throats appear red or mucus. It can be interesting, to fight against the development of pathogenic yeasts, candida, favored by a treatment with antibiotics, to give it also after a cure with antibiotics. It is likely that allicin exerts its main action at the level of the upper digestive tract, which is not so bad. When garlic is crushed or chewed, it turns into allicin, the main active ingredient. Allicin is one of the predominant sulfur compounds in garlic responsible for its characteristic odor and physiological action. It is produced during an enzymatic reaction of a lion, which is an inert chemical, in response to an attack, cut, crushed or crushed. Allicin has an antibacterial action. A medical journal notes that chopping or crushing fresh garlic cloves releases more allicin than using the whole cloves. However, the strongest benefits seem to diminish after 24 hours. Therefore, if you add it to food or drinking water, 
Be sure to repeat the operation after a maximum of 48 hours. Refresh the water after 48 hours, without adding garlic. Do this twice a week. If the pigeons do not drink, add less, then gradually increase the water quantity. Please note that some pigeons do not like garlic. You can try mixing some garlic powder into their favorite food, so they can consume the mixture, but success is far from guaranteed. Our pigeons are far from being fooled. Are you ready to include garlic in the feeding routine of your pigeons and young pigeons? Don't forget one thing. Garlic is not enough on its own. These virtues are maximum when given in addition to a suitable, rich and varied diet. In conclusion, garlic is a relatively cheap and easy product to use, that many fanciers choose to feed their pigeons. Of course, garlic shouldn't be considered a substitute for scientifically proven products, but used correctly, it won't do any harm either. Of course, if you are in the least concerned about the health of your pigeons, you should contact a veterinarian.